Good morning. It's Friday, October 19th. I'm Adam Ellis. Good morning. I'm Todd Eastburn. JHS Port is next. Veterans Day is November 11th. Do you have an immediate family member, parent, grandparent, sibling who has served in the military and now lives in the local area that you would like to honor this Veterans Day during a special assembly at Jeff High on November 9th? If so, please contact one of the JR JROTC cadet staff members with the name of your family member that would be available to attend this assembly in their honor. The next Fashion Club meeting will be held Wednesday after school in room F139, Miss Anderson's room from 2.30 to 4.30 p.m. Mr. Bowen will have after-school tutoring for math on Mondays from 2.30 to 3.30 p.m. in room D217. The yearbook staff is looking, to, looking for summer photos to be possibly published in the 2013 yearbook. Please upload your pictures to the Replay It website. Remember, if you have an Android mobile device or iPhone, you can download the Replay It application. Set up an account and submit pictures. There is no foreign language club meeting today. The next meeting will be Friday, October 26th. November 1st is a scheduled picture retake day. If you were unhappy with your original photos, you can retake them. You need to have your old package in exchange for the retakes. If you were absent, you will also take photos on this date. FCA shirts are on sale today. The cost is $10. All shirts must be paid up front. Sales will, be, sales will close October 26th. Questions? See an officer, Ms. Snelling or Ms. Rector. The National Honor Society is having a canned food drive October 22nd through the 26th. You can drop the cans off during all lunches. On one end of the can, write your presidential candidate choice, and on the other end, write your lunch period teacher. The class donating the most cans will win a pizza party. Winners will be announced October, November 5th. English teachers who teach seniors have been given information about senior pictures. All pictures will be taken by Wildlands Photography. Senior headshots will be taken at school, November 13th and 14th for $5. Or you can also call Wildlands to set up a studio appointment. The JHS Report is happy to air your announcement. Have a teacher or staff member email the announcement to Mr. Gross and we will do our best to make sure that announcement gets on the air. We will have the JHS weather forecast plus your latest Jeff High Sports after the break. I'm Miss Marla and this is my bakery, Marla's Place. I'm in Clarksville, Indiana. And my story is addiction. I lost two of my children last year to uh, a newer drug called Opana. My 24-year-old son, my 28-year-old daughter. It's a horrible drug and it's really affecting the lives of young people. The addiction is robbing our youth of their future and the life that the Lord has for them. It was always a dream of my son and I to start a bakery. So I decided that I would give up my job at the VA hospital and I would open up Marlis's place. Good morning. I'm Olivia McAtee with a look at today's JHS weather forecast. Today, clouds and showers, high 54. Tonight, partly cloudy and cool, low 44. Tomorrow, partly cloudy and a high of 60. That's a look at your JHS weather forecast. And here's a look at JHS sports with Supreme Court Justice Kraft. Good morning, I'm Justice Kraft with your latest Jeff High Sports. Floyd Central swept Jeffersonville in the IHSAA Volleyball Sectional Opener last night. 25-14, 25-6, and 25-6. Jenna Reinhardt had 11 assists, Sam Grider had 6 kills, and Marley Edwards had 12 digs. Sarah Garwood had 6 digs. Jeff says goodbye to 5 seniors in Brummett, Grider, Allie Whitlow, Samantha Keeling, and Shelby Rose. It's sectional week for several teams here at Jeff High. Tonight, it's the Red Devil football team playing host to New Albany in the first round of the IHSAA football tournament. Saturday, Jeff Cross Country runner Tyrell Daldell will participate in the Boys Brown County Semi-State Cross Country Meet. Good luck to our players and teams. Football sectional tickets are on sale during lunch today. All tickets are, all tickets are $6. All sports passes will not be permitted for the IHSAA tournaments. Girls Swimming and Diving begins Monday, October 22nd. The Red Devil Swimming and Diving team is looking for girls for this year's team, especially freshmen and sophomore girls. If you're interested, see Coach Gast in room C203 or Coach Dennis in room D134. Or just come to the first practice on Monday, October 22nd, after school, in the pool. Anybody that would like to be a girls basketball team manager this year needs to see Coach Pate as soon as possible. That's a look at sports. Stay tuned. A final word from the news desk is next. Hungry? Why not try Moby Dick Seafood? Voted number one for seafood in Clark County. We serve high quality cod, sliced and breaded daily. Delicious onion rings, sliced and breaded daily. Located at 1700 10th Street in Jeffersonville. Open till 9 p.m. Monday through Thursday, 10 p.m. Friday and Saturday, and 8 p.m. on Sunday. Stop by and enjoy our box for two or more for just 15 dollars 
or enjoy a whale of a sandwich. Would you like to do something special for a friend for their birthday? You can with WJHS birthday greeting. It's very simple. Bring six pictures and five dollars to date WJHS room H130 and we'll help you say happy birthday. That's the latest Jeff Hyde news. We hope you have a great day. I'm Tommy Burn. And I'm Adam Ellis. And thank you for watching the JHS Report.